The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. The problems in this section will also involve the slope formula. But unlike the previous section, where we were given the coordinates of two points that lie on our line and we were asked to find its slope. In this section, we'll be given the slope of our line and we'll be asked to find a coordinate that is missing from one of its points. That coordinate will be represented by the variable k. So to find k, we would start the problem by plugging all our given information in to the slope formula. Since our slope, or m, equals 2, we start by plugging a 2 in for m in our formula. So we have 2 equals y2 minus y1 would be k minus 1. x2 minus x1 would be negative 2 minus 3. Now we have an equation set up so we can solve for k. Our first step would be to simplify negative 2 minus 3 to get negative 5. So we have 2 equals k minus 1 over negative 5. To get rid of our fraction, we multiply both sides by negative 5. On the left, we have negative 10, and on the right our negative 5's cancel, and we're left with k minus 1. Add 1 to both sides, and negative 9 equals k. So if our line has a slope of 2, it must pass through the points 3, 1, and negative 2, negative 9. Try checking your answer by plugging those points in to the slope formula and see if you get a slope of 2.